YouTube. Your boy is back once again with another dating and relationships video. Don't just settle for anybody. Okay, now when I say the word settle, it's my belief that everyone settles, right? Actors, rappers, basketball players, everyone settles to a certain level because I believe that not everyone's going to find their perfect person. And the perfect person for everyone don't actually exist when I say perfect, yeah? So maybe you find someone, their looks are 10 out of 10, in your opinion, their body's 10 out of 10, but their dress sense might be 9 out of 10. Personality might be 8 out of 10. So that's not perfect. But, but that's not bad, is it? Right? So people settled, yes. What I'm saying is don't just settle for anybody. Now, this video is universal. Now, when I say it's universal, I'm saying it's for men and women. It's for those looking for a relationship and those looking to just casually date and sleep around. Yeah? So, I'm talking about relationship qualities. I'm talking about the way the person looks. Don't just settle for anybody. Now, let me give you an example. So... There might be a guy at a nightclub. He goes out regularly every weekend, you know, looking for girls to date and sleep with. Now, this guy, he's chatting to females, 8 out of 10s, 9 out of 10s, but he's not getting anywhere. Then some 5 out of 10 girl gives him the eye. So now it's towards the end of the night. So he thinks, mm, none of them other girls are on it. This girl's looking at me, let, let, let me chat to her. Then what does he do? He chats to the five out of 10. He gets her number. He goes to meet, so instead of going to the club the next Saturday, he goes to meet this five out of 10. Yeah. Whether he takes him her back to his house or they're going on a date. Let's say they're going on a date. So you don't, you don't even know if you're going to sleep with her the same night. Now, he settled for that 5 out of 10. Instead of, be, instead of going on that date with the 5 out of 10, he could be at the club the next Saturday, trying his luck again, and then that Saturday he bags the 8 out of 10, or 9 out of 10, or 10 out of 10. But no, he may have missed out on that opportunity because he's there, giving his time and energy to this girl that he perceives as a 5 out of 10, because he just settled. Do you understand? He could be using that time to be in the club again to try and, you know, get that high quality girl. Or he could be using that time to work on himself to make himself better. Yeah? Or he could be catching up on sleep. He could be doing whatever. Working on his new business. But he's giving his time and his energy to someone in his mind. Is a 5 out of 10. But he's just settled. What the fuck? Don't settle for just anybody. And when I say don't settle, yeah, you wait and you wait until the right, you know, if you're Drake or Leonardo DiCaprio or one of them boy there, yeah, you might not you might not need to do a lot of waiting because women will be coming to you. But if you're not in that position, don't just settle for anyone. Wait until the right um, person comes, whether you're looking for a relationship or whether you're just dating, whatever qualities you're looking for, yeah? Like, it's different for everyone, in it? Some people, you know, the ass has to be there. Like, they don't really care about the face. Or some people, the personality might be there. They don't really care about the body too tough. But and when I say wait for the right person to come, I don't mean just sit on your ass and wait. Utilise that time to think, why am I not getting these chicks I want? Or, or female thinking, why am I not getting these guys that I want? Why? So use that time to think about why you're not getting what you want. And when you realise what you can fix, fix it. It might be the way you look. It might be your personality. You might be going to the wrong places. Think. Yeah? Don't just sit. Don't just, okay, all right, yeah. The guy on a dating and relationship channel told me not to settle for anyone. Let me just wait for the right person to come. No! Figure out why it's not happening. 
let's let's give you another example. Let's say there's a overweight, out of shape female who's got low self esteem and is kind of a bit shy, and she don't go out much. She's sitting on her couch, saying, "I'm waiting for Mr. Right to come round. I'm waiting for a Mr. Right." I'm waiting for Mr. Right. Okay. First of all, you're at home all the time. You don't get out much. How, how, how are you going to find Mr. Right? Or how is he going to find you? Yeah? First of all. Secondly, if you're overweight and out of shape. Now, this female I'm talking about could have the best personality out of all the 4 billion females in the world. She could, have the, she could be number one in the world and females with best personality. But if you're not getting out much and you don't look that great with all due respect, you're out of shape, overweight. Trust me, there's guys out there who value a, a, a good personality. Millions. Yeah? But this channel is all about the real world, yeah? It's going to be difficult for you to get that guy if you don't look great. Why do you think McDonald's like has got red and yellow? Why do you think KFC has got some red and white sign? Attractive colours. Yeah? You need to be, you need to have some level of attractiveness. You don't need to be no size six model or whatever yeah but you need to have some kind of you, you need you need to look decent enough for guys to even look at you you need to go out yeah so don't just settle for anyone like you know some girls will you know settle for the bad boy because they like that image in fact females Going for bad boys, we're gonna do that video. Not on this, not on this video, but we're going to do that video. That's coming. Look out for it. Why women like bad boys? But anyway, that video is coming. But yeah, so women that like bad boys, they might. She might be so excited about that bad boy image that she lets everything else slide. He don't respect her. He don't give her time. But she's so excited about that bad boy image, she settles for that. So, oh, you look, yeah, his body is not, yeah, yeah, okay. She's attracted to that thuggy, thuggy. But she's not right for him. She's a relationship girl and she's going into a relationship with the bad boy and he disrespects her. But she settles for that. Why? Obviously, there's different reasons why people might settle. Some people might be lazy. Some people might have low self-esteem, low self-worth, whatever. But I'm telling all of you, male and female, relationship people and people that's just dating red pill purple pill and blue pill guys out there don't settle for just anybody that's it all right